Hey, Ono Smokestack members, this is Johnny C from New Jersey. We're doing a continuation of the carbon monoxide testing. What we are running today is not the generator yet. Uh, running this uh, Falcon over here it has absolutely no emissions controls. It's a 1964 Falcon uh, with a 1983 uh, 302 V8. It was uh, completely redone, modified, and all that. You could hear it, you know, the cam and all, whatever. We're in enclosed garage, total volume of the garage, I believe it's like 5,200 square feet. Uh, you could probably hear the smoke detect, smoke detectors, carbon monoxide testers going off. We got extremely high levels of uh, carbon monoxide. We're trying to get a picture of it okay. We got uh, 977 or so parts per million. I got a second detector on top of the uh, JB. Although I think it's on the JB or it might be on my workbench. I think it's on the workbench. Uh, the bolt chirping right now. I've been running the car in this enclosed garage for about 45 minutes at idle. Uh, it's doing rather well. Hasn't comped out. I'm sure I probably killed all the mice. We're going to go in the garage right now. We're going to go shut the uh, car off. We're going to get a close-up of this detector down here as well as the detector, the CO detector over there on the, on the workbench. And I see it now. Let's see if I can zoom in at it. Uh, unfortunately, I can't read. It's too far out of focus, too. All right, so let's go in. Uh, I don't want to stay in there too long because I'll probably uh, end up uh, as a victim. Although some people may like that. <laughs> okay, let's go in. All right, I did have it locked during the test, but it's open now. I'm going to close the door so I kill myself. All right, what do we have here for uh, CO? All right. We got 862 parts per million on the uh, far away detector. The close up detector, what do we got here? Uh, 975. It's approximately, I'm going to say, about six or seven feet away from the exhaust. This is dual exhaust. We got it coming out there. Although the car sounds like it's running rough, it's uh, the cam. All right, so I think it's time to shut this car off. It smells rather nice in here. Uh, okay. Oh boy, I feel lightheaded. Uh, let's see if I get in this car here. Uh, what do we got here anyway for temperature and all that? All right. All right, let's shut her down. Okay. Now we gotta get the hell out of this garage before I end up becoming a victim. Uh, hold on one second here. I know the camera's going kind of haywire, but we do have high levels of uh, CO in here. I want to get the hell out of here. I'm sure even though that the car is off, uh, I could probably still uh, fall victim of all this. So what do we have again? Let's see. Uh, 978 parts per million. Whew, man, my eyes are tearing too. Wow. Holy shit. Okay, let me get out of this garage. I can't even see anymore. Wow. All right, wow, eyes are tearing big time. Oh, that is bad. I'm sure there's more than just CO in there. All right, here's what we're gonna do. We got the car off. The garage is loaded with CO. Did I say CO2 before? I meant CO, carbon monoxide. I wanna see how long it takes for this uh, matter to get down to safe levels. So right now uh, I'm recording the time and I'm gonna come back and see what happens over time. All is being recorded. So I could uh, play it back and uh, get second-by-second second information as needed later on. Okay, so this is Johnny C. from New Jersey. I'm still alive. I survived. Uh, I'm sure if there's any mice in this garage, they did not. Okay, once this uh, test wraps up, my next test is going to be running the JB. Okay, it's hard to see. It's over there. Uh, on gas. Gasoline, I mean, first. We know that it's going to produce high levels. Uh, but I'm going to get a record of it as far as uh, the levels uh, in time. And then we're going to compare it to propane. It's going to be very interesting. Propane has been uh, running rather clean uh, with my heater. But let's see how it performs with the JB. Okay, that's it. And I'm very lightheaded right now, to be quite honest with you. As you probably hear, I'm starting to stutter when I'm talking. Okay, I think I better uh, breathe some fresh air. Take care. Bye.